This short video describes some of the visual features that help with the identification of Fraxinus ornus. The bark of this tree is light grey, smooth, remaining relatively smooth into maturity unlike Fraxinus excelsior. The upright white candy floss like flowers that appear after leaf emergence are also a useful feature for distinguishing Fraxinus ornus from other ash trees. The flowers don't often develop into fruit but where they do they form bunches of relatively thin pale uh, ash keys, samaras. On the spray the compound pinnate leaves are arranged in opposite pairs and the leaflets are noticeably broader and generally there are less leaflets than there would be on Fraxinus excelsior. Here we can see a close-up of the leaf, here only seven leaflets altogether, and notice how there's very little separation between the leaflets, in fact there's some overlap between them, which would be typical of this broader leaflet that you get to see on Fraxinus ornus. The form of the tree is relatively broad, open crowned, and becoming decurrent relatively quickly, breaking into a, a number of elongate branches, rarely reaching the heights of Fraxinus excelsior, typically reaching a height of between 12 to 15 meters at maturity and being relatively slow to mature. The winter buds are of a different hue from Faxinus excelsior. They're generally a light brown and rather velvety, um, opposite lateral buds and the terminal buds still having that mitre shape to them but being light brown as opposed to the black of Faxinus excelsior.